Hi, I'm Luca Congedo and you're watching from JS to Remote Sensing. In this tutorial, we're going to download and process subsets of satellite images. So first, we are going here to the SCP menu, Download Products. Here in the interface, we can set the search parameters here. First, we're going to add a base map, Ristrans OpenStreetMap, here with this button. Now that we have a base map, we can zoom to our steady area. For instance, here over Milan. We're going to create a search area here using this button. So we click this button and then in the map, left click and right click to define the corners of the search area. As you can see here, the coordinates. And then we select the product here. We can choose between Sentinel-2, Landsat images, uh, which are the only sources that we can download uh, the subset of these images. Next, we are going to enter here the parameters here, the maximum cloud cover, for instance, 30%. And then after we are set all the parameters, we can click find. You can see here the progress of the search. And here, these are the results, the list of images, the items with a gray background uh, should be requested and can't be downloaded directly. So here we choose from the available images here. We can select, for instance, an image with a very low cloud cover, for instance, this image. We click on the item and we can see here the preview. Then we click this button here to display the preview in QJS. We can see this is a very large area. And if we go back to the interface, we check and then check uh, the show button. And we can see here our search area over Milan, a very small subset of the original image here. And in order to download only a subset of the image, we should check this option here, virtual download. If we check this option, only a subset defined by the search coordinates will be downloaded. And then we can see these other options, only viewing layers to download only the images listed in QJS layers. We can also pre-process the images automatically. We can see also the download options where we can select only uh, single bands if we want and when we are ready we can click run and select an output directory here and we can see here the download process of course, the download process of a subset will be much quicker and uh, only the image under this uh, uh, red rectangle will be downloaded. Here, uh, you can see after the download and the processing, you can see all the bands that, are, that have been downloaded here. You can show and hide the rectangle. We can uncheck this, show. So we can see here the image. So we can see here the bands, only a subset of the original image has been downloaded and processed. This is a subset of a Sentinel-2 image. You can see here the very large original image and the subset that have been downloaded and loaded in the plugin. We can, for instance, display a false color composite here. The image, false colors, or natural color if we want. So only the image defined by the coordinates has been downloaded. We can also change the coordinates and for instance set a different area for a different subset here we don't need to perform uh, the search again we just change the coordinates left click and right click here 
and then we click run and we choose a different directory because of course the file names would be the same so for instance uh, directory subset 2 and then we can see here the process has started and the image will be downloaded and processed over this uh, new subset And we can see here the second subset that has been downloaded in QJS. So this can be a quicker way to download a portion of an image. Thank you for watching.